Figured you'd come back here. I just needed some time to think. Yeah, well, I hope you have. And I hope that whatever was wrong with you is gone now. Because one way or another, I need you to come with me tomorrow. You know, for the past couple of years, I thought we were in this together. But it's nothing like I thought it would be. I, I thought we were equals. We are. Do you really believe that? Everything we've accomplished, we did it together. That's what I promised to you the day we got married. It just always seems like it's about your life, not mine. I haven't made a single decision about what we do without asking you first. You know that. That's it. You make the decisions. Anything that I want, like seeing other men, it's like you control me. You know that if you were caught sleeping around, people would get suspicious. Just because we're married doesn't mean you can tell me what to do. What's wrong with being cautious? Because I need a life of my own. I hate myself. I don't recognize myself when I look in the mirror. I do things that I don't want to do, and it's driving me insane. If you wanted to be a dirty slut, maybe you should have just stayed home in Canada and married some dumb jock. Well, at least with him, I would have known where I stood. You don't get to have it both ways. You want everything just when it suits you. Stop being so fucking selfish. I am not being selfish. No, you are. It's the most important time of my life, and look at us. That's exactly it. Look at us. I thought we were gonna make each other stronger, but that was bullshit. I'm only here to keep your precious image from falling apart. You've made me weak and small, and I just can't put up with it anymore. And what the fuck do you want me to do? It seems like everything I've done for you just isn't enough. Like this nice apartment isn't enough. Like all the money I have isn't enough. Not enough. Not enough. No. It's you who's not enough. When we're found out because of you, you'll have nothing. No plan. You'll only be a has-been. Here's the brutal fucking truth, Elizabeth. Without me, you are nothing. Yeah, you're right. This marriage has been about one thing. And if you can't realize what that is, then maybe I'm a fool for having married you in the first place. And I don't have time to be a fool. I need to do my job and uphold my image. And it's about damn time for you to uphold yours. You want me to be a different man? Yeah, fine. I'll be a different man. You're gonna get in that car and go to the conference and smile and shake hands and stand with me in front of the entire company and be my fucking wife. You'll do all that. I don't give a fuck if you vomit on your own time. Look, I guess I should apologize for last night. I might have taken things a little bit too far. It's fine. I made you breakfast. Hey. And I meant what I said. We're two equal partners. I'm sorry. I'm sorry too.